what is up guys and welcome to another take into video this is the third part of it and in the previous video we learned about frames labels how to get text output and entry fields and in this video we'll be learning about uh, message box uh, event handling and event handling with buttons so let's begin let's get rid of it and we have title and geometry over here so first of all we'll uh, import a message box which is pretty simple you just have to like write import take enter dot message box box and that's pretty much of it for message box and will be creating a button for that we'll create a but one object and the actual method button and root the take into with uh, window object then we'll provide a text to it is equal to click word font is equal to times 18 bold close and we'll provide something like pad x is equal to 4 and pad y these are some of the um, like functions or we can call it as modifications you can do to a button there are various things you can do with it will get everything when you type in help in the terminal and you can see what what else can you do with the button and we'll just go close this and place a button one and just pack it we just don't use the place one it's hard to calculate x and y so we'll just simply pack it and we'll provide this as 20 so the button will look big i guess so this is a button we'll just provide something like background and fo foreground color background and foreground color so background color is equal to powder blue that's a light color so i just like it and foreground color means you'll just see in a minute and let's keep it as green close and comma So this is it for a button and foreground background color pack and save and run so you can see foreground color of uh, foreground color means something which we apply a color to a the text on the button and background color is something the color required for the button so clip clickable so we'll now just provide an even handling function to a button so when i click a button what will happen so for that we'll just need to create a function function just for an example i'll just show you how to exit from the window when i click on a button so we'll just not write exit the function name is exit and i'll just use the message box to provoke the method so take enter dot message box dot show info this is something like title this on um, as you can see provided over here title and the message uh, what will appear beyond uh, above it and below it so the title will be um, example example and and the message will be uh, do you want to do you want to exit So 
and we'll provide, uh, di uh, directly put an ex uh, exit function which you don't have to like it's an inbuilt function so you don't have to do anything just type in like that and for binding it with a button you just have to create another comma command is equal to the function name which is exit so that's pretty much of it exit just exit you don't have to uh, use any phrases or uh, circle brackets this is yep and that's it so um, what here I've done is that I've just created a button and a function when I click on that button which is click what will happen is that a message box will appear uh, asking do you want to exit and when I click it will just destroy the window entire including the main window so just save and run so as you can see example and this is the message box which I've created and the question and do you want to continue so everything is closed this is how you can do various things with it like you can create uh, different things and you can provide different methods to a button as per as your requirements but this is just an example I've shown you how to create a binding function you just have to create a function and and depending upon your requirement if you want to add or place any button in it you just have to write the method inside that function the entire method and just uh, use the function just the exit not the phrases not the brackets over here inside the button command and that's it you just have to use the function and the command method that's it and you have just binded the button with the function so yep and pretty much this is it run clicked this is the message box ok and that's the exit so this is it guys thanks for watching and talk to you in the next one